Hey guys, Sasha for Apple Still at the Samsung event at the Soho building, and uh, yeah, you've seen this little fellow over here. Oh no, turn around that side because you need to know that it's not for sale in Germany. Hint, hint, hint. Hello, Apple. Anyways, over here we have the very first Samsung Galaxy Tab that they launched during IFA 2010 over here in Berlin, just exactly a year ago. And I'm also a user of this uh, very first Samsung Galaxy Tab that I just switched off. And thank God there is a little unlocking code. And uh, what I would like to show you are the differences between these two devices. Um, okay, here we go. Now the accelerometer is kicking in. Well, first of all, this is sporting a 7-inch... I'm not even sure if this is an IPS display, but that was 1024 by 768. No, actually it was 1024 by, uh, by 600. It was, a, it was a 6 to 9 uh, ratio, while this is uh, a 7.7-inch, 7 .7 1280 by 800, so the DPI is, of course, much higher over here. And as you can see, look at the colors. Right? The Super AMOLED colors are, are absolutely brilliant. And of course, when it comes to the thickness of these two devices, obviously the old Samsung Galaxy Tab is on the bottom, while the new one is on the top. It's also, this is like 535 grams, and I think this one was like almost 600 grams. I don't even know the wheel specs anymore. That one was based on an ARM Cortex A8 single core cro uh, processor with one gigahertz. This is the Exynos, uh, based on an ARM Cortex A9 dual core 1.4 gigahertz processor, and of course it's also running Android Honeycomb 3.2. Well, this is um, not sure. That looks to me like a custom ROM at least. Um, this is based on uh, Android Froyo 2.2, uh, but you can also get some custom ROMs with Gingerbread for this little device. Huge development in just one year. Uh, way more performance with this device. Absolutely brilliant display. You can see when we're taking a look at the viewing angles. This is absolutely cool. And uh, I'm also sure that this is a little bit more expensive because you can grab a Wi-Fi Samsung Galaxy Tab right now for way below 300 euros, I think 250 euros, while this device should be with this, with this display. A 7.7 .7 inch Super AMOLED display is definitely not cheap. I would guess like at least 500 euros. I would guess maybe even more, like 700 euros. Anyways, really cool device and you can see the evolution of tablet computing from South Korea. The very first Samsung Galaxy Tab 7 inch and the brand new Samsung Galaxy Tab 7.7. .7. I'm Sasha from NetbookNews.com. Thanks for watching.